This question asks, a jet plane lands with a speed of 118 meters per second and can accelerate at a maximum rate of negative 5.2 meters per second squared as it comes to rest. From the instant the plane touches the runway, what is the minimum time needed before it can come to rest? Okay, so it, the acceleration, we have the acceleration, which is negative 5.2, and we have our initial velocity, is 118 meters per second and our final velocity is going to be zero we want it to come to rest meters per second and saying what's the minimum time needed to get it to that zero well we can do um, our our formula for acceleration so acceleration equals um, vf minus vi divided by t and we can solve for t so t would equal VF minus VI over A. So our VF minus our VI is going to be negative 118. So we'll just go ahead and negative 118 meters per second divided by the acceleration is going to be divided by negative 5.2 meters per second squared and that should give us our time, which is approximately um, 22.7 seconds. It's supposed to be an S. Approximately 22.7 seconds for our time. Then it asks the question, can this plane land on a small tropical island airport where the runway is 800 kilometers long? So let me draw us a graph. This is our time. This is our velocity, and what, we're, what we know is that our final velocity is 118, and our time is 22.7 seconds. And we want to know that this is the minimum distance it, it requires to stop. So is that distance greater than 0.8 kilometers or 800 meters? So is this distance... Uh, greater. So what is the distance? It's base times height over 2. So um, 22.75 seconds times 118 meters per second divided by 2. What does that equal? 22.75 times 118 divided by 2 equals 1,342.25 meters. We need uh, a little uh, a little over one and one third kilometers to stop this plane so no it cannot land on that island um, so that's the answer for that